up or get into anything, you have to do it because you love it. Yeah. And then if you love it, you'll have a passion and you will stick with it despite what's going on. Yeah. But uh, if you don't love it, it's being a comedian or an actor oh. or being in construction. I Not got in construction you. and I didn't love it, dude. I lasted eight days. It was, it was one <laughs> of the too. worst eight Me days. Too. Me too. Eight days, dude. I've never been that fucking exhausted. I was just a oh. grunt. I remember I, I couldn't make enough sandwiches. I would be eating three sandwiches for lunch, and I was still losing Starving. weight. Still losing weight. We were roofing in July. Oh. And, yeah, it's not a redhead. Right. And I was just oh, – so I, I remember the, 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 my favorite part of the, that fucking job in the eight days was we had to – you know, you snap the chalk line for, uh, to line the thing up on the board. We were doing it in the basement of the house, that which was all fucking dirt, and it was actually cool down there. <laughs> and we were redoing this house, and I remember – I'm hanging outside an unfinished window, sticking the thing up, making the scaffolding for this Irish guy who kept going, Billy, you must work quicker. <laughs> and I was like, listen, man, I never put one of these fucking things up before. You want me to go faster? I'll go faster. And he's like, ah, oh, you're fucking shite. And, I was <laughs> and right over the fence was this house with a pool and it was summer vacation. There was kids like my age. And you could see it was like the quarterback of the football team, these hot chicks and all. That's my whole life. And they would, I remember one time you kept just up and just looking up my at me. And I was just going, what the fuck am I doing with my – I have my whole life oh, dude. to fucking be miserable. <laughs> oh. I should be doing what that – I mean, dude, they were just like – like that's and, a and, different thing. And because thing. they were so good looking, you could tell they were popular. He didn't have one ounce of guilt. Like me, if I stretched out, I would have looked at him and been like, I would have like started cleaning the pool. I would have felt guilty. This guy had no guilt. He did everything but just sit there drinking iced tea and give me the little toodaloo. This is the fucking worst thing I've ever. Well, done. if I don't love what I'm doing, I'm the worst worker of all time. <sighs> I break stuff, steal stuff, quit. It's just not for me. So there was a guy on the construction site, too, who wore the same jeans every day, <laughs> and he had no underwear on, and there was a giant <laughs> hole right Shut to the up. left of his fucking junk where, where the pocket should be. And I remember one point I was bent down picking something up, and he stepped over something, and the hole moved like this, like like – Junk in the back. I remember standing up, but he, like, but he was the brother of the guy I was working for. I just want to be like, dude, you, you want to put some fucking give, something, some evil Knievel fucking underwear, something, something on, underwear, something, something. Bro, something, wrap it up. How, just how when you didn't think you get any worse. Fucking duct tape, dude. I'll never he just stepped right over. And you know, I thought it was weird then, but now, like, you know, with all the information now about yeah. fucking weird, like, like I thought he was he was getting he was getting off on something, man. Like, like that's just fucking weird. Hey boys, look at yeah, this. That's, that's weird. fucking yeah. That's weird. And as not fuck. in like a gay way. I no. just think in general he was just like oh, a weird bird. Yeah, sort of peeing on his territory. Like, <laughs> oh. hey, don't forget who you're working for. That's my junk. dick. Here you dick in your back. <laughs> Here's my situation. You fucking you yep. fucking prepubescent college boy. Oh, dude. I mean that was. It was so fucking shocking. Like if I sat down with the police sketch artist, I could still fucking I could get it about eighty percent. Here, here are the weeds over here, and here's the dead body. Here's the dead body with a mass. 